गाइस दिस इज मालिंकी वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल वॉइस ऑफ मालिंकी टुडे वी विल टॉक अबाउट पैसिव ट्रांसपोर्ट एंड एक्टिव ट्रांसपोर्ट एंड इफ यू आर न्यू इन माय चैनल प्लीज सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल एंड इफ यू लाइक माय वीडियो प्लीज टू लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माय वीडियो सो सिंपल डिफ्यूजन इज अ वेरी सिंपल प्रोसेस वेयर अ पर्टिकुलर सब्सटेंस पासिस थ्रू द बायोलॉजिकल मेमब्रेन फ्रॉम अ high concentration area to a low concentration area in this picture we can see this molecule has the higher concentration in this side of the cell that means in the extracellular space and its concentration is lower in cytosol that means a clear concentration gradient is formed any type of gradient forms when there is a difference as concentration difference is maintained here it is a concentration gradient if this occurs this substance will move spontaneously from outside to inside down the concentration gradient this is called simple diffusion in this case these substances just cross the plasma membrane they don't need any assistance from a particular protein or energy generally gases cross plasma membrane in this way in facilitated diffusion also substances pass through the biological membrane from a high concentration area to a low concentration area that means down the concentration gradient in this picture we can see this molecule has the higher concentration in this side of the cell that means in the extracellular space and its concentration is lower in cytosol so this molecule will move from outside to inside but unlike simple diffusion this process requires an assistance a protein molecule which is embedded in the plasma membrane facilitates the transport of this molecule hence it is called facilitated diffusion this type of proteins are called carrier protein transporter proteins or channels now you may ask why the assistance is required so polar molecules and large ions dissolved in water cannot diffuse freely across the plasma membrane due to the hydrophobic nature of the plasma membrane hence they require an assistance only small and non polar molecules can easily cross plasma membrane without any assistance which occurs in simple diffusion like simple diffusion in facilitated diffusion also energy is not required both simple diffusion and facilitated diffusions are called passive transport as they do not require any energy in active transport molecules move against the concentration gradient that means from lower concentration to higher concentration in this picture we can see this molecule has the lower concentration in cytosol and its concentration is higher in extracellular space or outside the cell so this molecule will move from inside to outside like facilitated diffusion this process also requires assistance which would be provided by a membrane embedded protein in this process this protein is called pump why it is called pump because it requires energy from atp to transport molecules against the concentration gradient anything requires energy to do a particular task might be called pump 
This pump breaks down an ATP molecule, yields ADP and inorganic phosphate. The energy yield after the breakdown of ATP will be used to transport molecules.